Hey everyone, so today is the day that my product comes in that I need to take pictures of for the Amazon listing. Now, in this video, I'm not actually going to be doing that. I'm actually talking about the hype train type stuff that's coming towards, um, coming because of, well, I'm excited that I get to actually finally freaking do this after learning how to do it in, like, May. So, um, you know, three months later, can finally actually do this. But my main thought is not whether or not my product succeeds. That is already, like, I've decided it's going to succeed or it's not going to succeed. I can do the best I can. Um, I think I'm at actually an advantage because I know where, um, I know just from my experience where, like, underpriced attention is, Ooh, and uh, stuff like where the best place is, whether you advertise on Google, Facebook, or Instagram, or YouTube, or God knows where else. And I'm just excited to learn from this one. Yes, it's literally like anything, it's an investment. This is definitely a little bit of a bigger investment, but if it doesn't succeed, I'm going to learn a lesson. You know, I'm going to learn lessons of stuff like proper marketing is, what the proper pictures are, stuff like that. And I've actually, since you know eBay has been giving me the preview experience, so this one I feel very confident that I can at least figure it out. And I don't expect, by the way, I don't expect under any circumstances that the first month I'm going to do very well. I feel like the first month is going to be the worst month that I ever have because i got to figure it out still. You know, i got to figure out what pictures work, what tags work, what tags don't, marketing on certain tags, marketing on other tags. God knows all that other stuff, and it, it's going to be challenging. But this sets up the premise for launching other Amazon products that will be successful. Um, something I don't talk about a lot is cryptocurrency investing, because I don't do it anymore. I don't like it anymore. But when I was into it, I learned, um, I invested in Bitcoin at $15,000. Actually, it was Litecoin first. Litecoin at like something like 60 bucks went up to friggin' two, three hundred dollars, whatever it went up to, and I decided to hold on to it, and sold it, did some crypto day trading, and I ended up, after I decided to cash out some stuff, um, and I just put it all in Ethereum and let it sit there. It was, it was the same price, literally the same price. Same with Steam. Invested in Steam, same price. So I ended up with $2,000. Even though I missed out on literally about $4,000, right? And this, I'm going to regret this basically until Amazon takes off. I every, every time I talk about this, I regret it, even though I know that the lessons I learned literally set the foundation for everything else in business. I learned, next time I started trying messing with Ethereum, I learned some things that saved me a loss of $500 and also gained me extra money off of Steam. It gained me, I want to say, an extra something like $1,000, right? So it saved me a loss of 500 that I would have made otherwise, and it gained me a thousand. So, that is that. What I also took from the crypto investing part is that, and this was very apparent to me after crypto investing, not so much with everything else like YouTube, is that I'm going to make financial mistakes during this Amazon process. And I just have to push through, learn from them. And even though this is my first product, most likely going to be a loss. It sets up a success for every other product I launch. Like, every other product. So, take a loss on this first product, have patience, build up funds to make launch a second product, then third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seven, eight, nine, ten. Right? So make ten, maybe even twenty. Maybe hire someone, manage a hundred products on Amazon. That would bring me a lifestyle. Right now, it sucks, but... I know that I'm going to learn from it. Already, I've learned some things on Amazon that'll save me a lot of money. Like, for instance, I'm shipping from China. Making sure that before I even communicate with the people, 
I have a shipping ID and a reference ID ready, and that it goes to a warehouse that is desirable, like Arizona, rather than South Carolina. Okay? So, that means that every, t every shipment, literally, with these computer monitor stands, every shipment, if I make sure it goes to a place like Arizona, it saves me in between two to five dollars a unit, right? If I order, let's just say 200 units a batch, that saves me an extra thousand dollars of mistakes that I wouldn't be spending, right? Just because I'm shipping to Arizona rather than being like, ah, Texas, it's good enough. South Carolina, it's fine. Alaska, whatever. So it's, it's an experience, again, just like with the vlogging thing of making mistakes and learning from them, except the stakes are higher because I'm spending money, and if this fails, I'm back to square one, but with more knowledge. It's very interesting. Like, I literally don't, I have like, I have, I have some stocks in Facebook now, but when I bought my products, you know, I only had... Like I'm making three fifty a month just from the job, right? Three fifty a month. I spend one fifty, so it's literally two hundred. So I make two hundred a month. I spent twelve fifty on these products. So think about that for a second. Just doing the job, that's five months of work. Right? Then you tack on well the steam. That was literally a thousand dollars. Ended up being two thousand dollars of cryptocurrency. That you know, that's a bit better. So, this is a big investment for me because I stopped. I stopped doing Steam because I don't like Steam. I don't like the. I think the premise isn't there yet. So, if this doesn't succeed, I mean, of course, I have the eBay. eBay is the new thing, and if I really needed to freelance, but that's a different video. So I'm excited. I'm excited. Scared, not so much because I know that. Basically, if this if this fails, I already know that I have like a plan. If it succeeds, then uh, my plan happens two years faster than it usually does than than it should. Plain and simple. Basically, I'm treating this as a loss is normal, a win is a bonus, and I'm expecting the win. That's really what it comes down to. Even though this most likely will lose, I'm betting on the win. So that's it for this video, guys. The next video it will be me. Probably something like unboxing the stand, taking pictures of it, talking about it, showing off the listing. And then literally after that is the... I have to wait for some ad information. So that's it for this video, guys. If you enjoyed, you can tell me in the comments below. I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer. I suck just as bad as you do at vlogging. And I will see you in the next episode, stream, or vlog of whatever I decide to make.